Paddle boarding is fun, but it's important to have what you need before taking your board out on the water. Playing on the water is fun, but safety first. Madison Levy and her friends are visiting Pensacola Beach from Georgia. Some of us are doing the tandem kayaks, some of us are doing single kayaks, and then we have a few of us who are actually going to try something new today and do the stand-up boards. She's excited. It's her first time paddle boarding. Say you're going to place one knee here and then one knee here until you feel comfortable, okay? She's headed out with a group at Key Sailing. The manager recommends going out with others. Paddle boards, kayaks, stuff like that, we try to keep people as groups as opposed to like on the power boats where we're keeping them separated because if somebody falls off their paddleboard and it goes flying away, it's very easy for someone on another paddleboard to just swim over there, grab it, and paddle it back for them. This is what the Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission call a sound producing device. You have to have one on board and you must also have a wearable Coast Guard approved life jacket. It must be the appropriate size and within easy access. You do have a life jacket on the board. You don't have to wear it. I know they leave funny tan lines. I've got my life jacket and my whistle. I'm ready to go. Reporting on Pensacola Beach, Ricky Van, Channel 3 News.